hello guys so in this video I'm gonna show you a battle of the tournament searching the Nautilus and uh, this account is not mine and I did not play this battle but it was still an interesting battle and I would like to share this now you see the battle map is Cuba first uh, having construction yard three barracks here power plant supply center and infantries are coming out all coming using the narrow pathway through this point because uh, infantry of the resistance can go through the jungle that's their advantage especially in this map uh, while they try to collect the resource containers so all these infantry are down and that uh, they also took some resources although I think the resistance player did get more resources now you see there are two shipyard and Del Caymans are already out and there is uh, two supply centers that the red player space and some infantry here. And what the blue player is trying to do that sending deltas immediately uh, instead of gathering them all together. So although the Caymans are weaker so that's initially giving a little opportunity to kill down the deltas if they keep coming instead of focusing on their side. Uh, but probably one Cayman will die here and that happened when Cayman actually did die but two deltas are dead in the process now there are also a lot of deltas here so it's not very much preferable to go attack right now so he's retreating more uh, caimans are being const uh, produced and you see you now resource containers this will be collected and both sides took one container you see the first container always come to the to your base and that's what happened both the resistance and confederation player did collect their side of resources however because of deltas uh, extra excessive firepower in their early stage confederation might be able to push a lot harder and if they are able to do that once it's uh, it will become easier for them because they will keep on getting more resource container but for now uh, he's up going to upgrade this shipyard into THQ level 2 and while this guy is going with all this delta to attack here he will attack this shipyard because this is where there is much less probability of having resistance and there will be minefields placed around here so that even if uh, this delta come out they will be immediately destroyed so I guess those uh, deltas there are, are going to retreat and try to attack here and as expected they're coming out and now he's ordering delta if those deltas come out those delta will die now only choice he has is that he will have to use these delta to deactivate those minefields otherwise those will die simply all right so what happened I don't know uh, wasn't was there really a minefield there because this Delta did not get this did not get destroyed however more Caymans are here and Caymans are focusing on a single K, uh, Delta and trying to destroy it as soon as it can and meanwhile alligators are already uh, almost about to be construct produced and this guy's just upgrading this shipyard into level 2 so this guy is still far from having a viking but as i said the deltas are still showing their power and they also collected this container so they definitely have more capability to make a comeback now one viking will be produced now if a viking is produced at this point this will be very bad thing for the resistance player You see this viking production has to be stopped so what he's trying to do is that he will probably use a minefields in front of the shipyard but before that happened uh, before that happened the viking got ready unfortunate but yes 
seeing uh, the battle at such stage, it almost looks clear that the uh, resistance player is going to lose. However, he's still going to try and win this battle and he will actually do win. Three Cayman will kill down one Delta very easily without taking any losses and going to take these two containers as well. And this guy came here and found out that the red player is going for grenadiers. Producing grenadiers because UC Cuba map is good for a rush attack, especially using this jungle. So a good place for the resistance to attack if they want to rush. And we'll have one naval platform here as well. Now lots of infantries are here already. There was an infantry scout. So probably the blue player has made some uh, defense arrangements for that. Okay, the blue player collected another big container here. More infantries are being produced. Alright, so we can see here that only just a one shipyard level two another one still level one so producing they're produ probably producing more vikings all right so here now this will there will be the attack with all these infantries there are also a few riflemen and mostly they are grenadiers so the enemy also had assault and bunkers here And another big container arrived here and the enemy ships are very close to it and enemy definitely has a lot more ships at the ocean. Now he's going to advance forward. Now you see the infantry are like in a shape of a concave curve. And here they are going to collect these containers too. But the losses at the land uh, that the blue player had to withstand is actually quite huge. Although the blue player got 6 containers out of 10. If they explore 4 more sites they will be the winner. So the blue player actually decided that they will go forward and try to crush the red player's base from the ocean. And the attack from the rampaging attack from these infantries are still going on although many infantries already died. Now there are five vikings and you see those alligators did not do much of the damage. So that bunker destroyed but there are pretty less infantries and he's still trying to send infantries because if he managed to destroy the blue player's base he will be able to win this. Oh, so this Viking got hit under that minefield. If there were more, then probably uh, it could have been very more, much more difficult for the blue player to do something. Now, they're going to collect this container. That's what the blue player will try to do, I think. Because they still have naval units. If they uh, collect this, then they will have a better probability of winning. Uh, still, that guy needs three sites to explore. Uh, but he cannot produce any land units now considering his condition. He just has the, his naval units. That's all he has right now. And still trying to move inside using the deltas. But deltas are not good against grenadiers. They might be good against helicopters or caimans. But not against grenadiers. So deltas are much more better to deal with these vikings if they're within their firing range so this guy uh, is still not trying to capture it okay so that guy actually did capture this one and they had just 
two more sites to capture but before that all the last buildings of the blue player destroyed so that's how this game ends okay so this was the opponent all right so that's all for this video Thank you.